Hey everyone, today we're going to show you how to use the plugin Chat Color on your Minehut server. Welcome to Minehut Tutorials! <laughs> I've never felt more welcome in my entire life. <laughs> Hello, Trent and Michael. Have you ever wanted to make your Minecraft chat color a different color? You are nodding your head as if saying yes. Wonderful. I will show you how to do this thing. <laughs> with, with chat color. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so you can check out what you currently have just by doing slash chat color. It'll say your color is currently this. So right now it's just a gray. It's the default gray. If you want to boring. see what you can use, I know, boring, right? If you do chat color space available, you can see what you have to use. You can even modify to do crazy stuff like underscores and italics. Crazy, oh. right? <laughs> <laughs> underscores? So, I don't know if I'm ready for underscores. <laughs> So, I might dabble in italics for a little bit first and then see if I can graduate to underscores. So my favorite color is red. So I chose red. So I did chat color space four. Okay. Uh, and then I also want it to be italicized. So I'm going to do chat color space four space O. Red italics. <laughs> so what crazy cool colors did you guys choose? Did y'all choose any? Am I the only one? Uh, to choose a color. You have to oh. give us permission. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. Yes, make sure you make make them operators so they can change their colors. Remember to do chat color available. Mm -hmm. How do I do a All modifier? Right. You just do the letter. I do like B L. Okay. Yeah, B L. I don't know what letter the. Uh, that first one is. I assume it's a. Oh, and you can even MC, hex code? JJK. I think it's a K. I think it's a K. Hi. Oh, look at that cute sky blue. Oh, is that a bold? I think that's bold. I think yellow's bold. Hi. What you got, Michael? What color did you choose? Oh. I don't think I want anything <laughs> special. I think I. Wait, that's invalid? How are you doing it? Maybe I can help you. There we go. No, I got it. I, you'll see right now. Good learning opportunity. You got it, Michael? I got yes. it! Oh, look it's at you. Orange. What if I do chat color? Of my color. Favorite juice. I'll do zero and K. <laughs> I, oh, I, uh, what is that? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's what that is. <laughs> that's terrible. <laughs> And then if you want to, <laughs> I know it's, yeah, that's for things you don't want people to read. <laughs> this is a good idea. See, the and joke is wanna... funny because it's very clearly not a good idea. Oh, yes. Um, and if you want to be, uh, if you want to be pride colors, you can do chat color, space rainbow. Rainbow. <laughs> so cool. I like that one a lot. Um, but yes, you can also do hex code. So I'm going to do chat color. And then I'm going to do number 0099FF. Ooh, mine hut Ooh, that's blue. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. That's a nice color. Nice. Mine hut blue. <laughs> you can also make it italicized. What was that? Oh. No, let's do underscore. We'll do in. Mine hut. <laughs> <laughs> nice. nice. And if you want to get back to default, just do chat color default. Oops, I again misspelled default. Here we go. Now it is default. This. Boring. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make you all default. What? You're like the bad guy in The Incredibles. <laughs> when everyone's special, nobody is. <laughs> all right, now you're all default. By putting your name after chat color and then space default, I can make whatever I want you to be. 
We're gonna do this. Now I know how default players feel in the lobby. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what color are you now, Michael? Chat to see. I, I don't know. I have a color pie. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> right, yeah, I, get print. Color. I think it was red. It wasn't like the dark red that you had. It was more like a like a pink red, if I had to guess. But it was not like I, a lighter red. Yeah, I, I, I'll never be certain. If it's ever an in-between color, I just, I'm not going to be able to answer. Here's something that might help. If you do chat color space GUI, the GUI, <laughs> this will make it a little easier to choose what you want. I think oh, I'm going to wow. do light yes. purple. This is and much better. bold. Bold. Uh -uh. <laughs> I think that's really nice. And then you can change the settings going to settings help you can see everything you want you can auto save the data you can save interval etc etc look through the look through the settings see what you want to do um you can, can you also give, change can you give people uh permission to use just specific colors on your server so if you wanted to have different ranks with different colors is that possible you can actually with luck perms you gotta have luck perms installed to do that if you don't know how to use luck perms We've got a tutorial for that. Oh, we have a tutorial. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can set different group defaults uh, and give permissions with luck firms. It works with a lot of different plugins, I have found out. And if you want to set your entire server to have a default color, we can do that too. I keep misspelling default. Chat color space set space default dash color and we'll do seven. Are you sure you want to do that? Yes. Confirm. Default. I changed it to... Actually, let's change it to something prettier. Let's do... What's three? I do want to do that. I'm going to confirm this color. All right. Everyone set your color back to default and we'll see what color that is. Ooh, <laughs> that's nice. So this is, this is now the default color for the Minehut tutorial server. Until I change it again, which uh, maybe I will. Uh, Sprunkle power. <laughs> uh, you can also set like the join message colors. You can turn them off. Uh, well, sorry, I can make it so join message is currently true. You change it to false. I'm going to confirm that. Join message has been set to false. You can do chat color space set notify. Notify others false. So were you guys seeing that I changed your color? Or yes. Well, now you don't know. Mm. I'm going to change uh -oh. Trent's color to something, and he won't know what it is. Uh oh, I'll guess. All right, Trent, what you got? Purple. Ah, no, I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Nerd. All right, I'm it's going so to cursed. Say. It's so cursed. All right, I've set yours now, Michael. Oh, I'm stuck in the cave. Cat 27. Hello. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, There's also one more cool thing you can do. So you can set rainbow, you, but you can also make it a custom rainbow sequence. Ooh. I'm going to do that really fast. We have one here. Custom rainbow. I'm going to confirm that. Whoa, this is sick. Uh, so if we do chat color rainbow. Hey. Look, it's like pastel colors. Oh, that's really nice. So pretty. It reminds me of Color Me Mine. <laughs> Trent is still stuck. <laughs> Don't worry, Trent. Oh. <laughs> what? You made a sign? I, I, I was like, help, I can't talk I can't to communicate. <laughs> <laughs> help, I can't talk to Trent. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Trent, I'll help you. 
I'll make you rainbow. Hi. It's something long you have trend. To write, you have to write longer sentences. Yeah. Thank you, Carl, for the new chat format. I appreciate it. <laughs> what a polite, what a polite boy. You are most welcome, Trent. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, that is pretty much everything we're going to teach you uh, about this. But if you use luck perms, like we said, uh, it opens up a whole lot more. It's just like setting up different groups. Like say you have moderators that you want to be different from admin, that you want to be different from subs, etc., etc. They can have uh, different colored uh, text. So if you do you. Uh, install this plugin and use it, let us know what colors and how you used it, or let us know what color you are in the Mindhut lobby. Yeah, that'd be great.